to share a rare story this morning about a woman who got a stunning surprise after the fight of her life. It begins with a bad break and a frightening diagnosis. Chip Reed has more. When Doris Crippen broke her arm in May. I laid there for 24 hours before I was found, and I thought I was going to die. The diagnosis was even more devastating. She had COVID-19, a risky proposition for someone who's 73. COVID is something I never want to ever get again. But the bitter pill became easier to swallow when Doris met her medication aide, Bev Boro, at this rehab center outside Omaha, Nebraska. When you first saw her, what went through your heart and your mind? I just couldn't believe that she was actually here. It's like, oh my God, I think this is my sister. Crippen doesn't hear very well, so Boro picked up a whiteboard. And then I showed it to her. And it says, is your father Wendell, Wendell Huffman? Huffman. Mm -hmm. And you showed that to her. Mm -hmm. And Doris, what was your reaction when you saw that? My mind's racing. I'm thinking, why is she asking me this question for? <laughs> I don't know her at first. <laughs> But she did look kind of familiar. Familiar, it turns out, from 53 years ago. The last time I seen Beverly is when I rocked her in my arms. <laughs> but she's too big today to do that. Their father was a trucker. He would have my mother go out on the road with him and left us with a 10 and 11 year old to take care of six months to five years old. So the neighbor called the state. Boro, just six months old at the time, was sent to foster care. Crippen, who was 20 and living elsewhere, tried to locate her. I've been searching for my sisters for over 53 years, but I knew they were out here, but I just never could find them. Now they're finding new family through each other. So far, <laughs> I'm really bonding with my sister. So you see each other a lot now. Yes, it's hard on these residents and patients when you can't have a visitor. And with her, I see her like three or four times a day. Would it be fair to say there have been a lot of tears since you two got reunited? Oh, yes. And now a new chapter in this sister act. I can't wait till when I can get out and if I can go spend some time with her and meet her husband and meet her children. Oh, it's going to be amazing. I guess it was God's plan that this happened because if I didn't have the COVID, I would have never found my sister. For CBS This Morning, I'm Chip Reed. What wow. a reunion, Vlad. <laughs> what a reunion. I love it when she said she looked kind of familiar. <laughs> 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 through this adversity, through this horrible pandemic, what a beautiful story, Chip Reed. I loved it. I had my mouth open the entire time. Yeah, and the pictures of the two of them together are really great.